Am I the asshole? For insulting a colleague because she wouldn't stop teasing me about where I went to school. I am a recent college graduate from a university that is very well known thanks to a certain character in the show The Office. I'm used to being teased about it, but anything related to Andy Bernard just gets on my last nerve. After four years of the same joke, I just see it as so uncreative and irritating that people perceive all of us like that, but it's largely been a non-issue. I just started working at this law firm as a legal assistant and my firm has a couple other recent college graduates. Ally just started a few weeks ago and is very proud of the fact that she graduated from Harvard wears her college sweatshirts to work, has a crimson white color theme at her desk, recounts college stories at lunch, etc. Ever since she saw a little graduation pennant that I have pinned on my desk, she keeps teasing me with worst Ivy jokes and keeps calling me Andy even though that's not my name. I've asked her several times to cut it out. Today was our monthly firm lunch where everyone introduced themselves because we had a few new people. After I gave my generic elevator pitch and said where I graduated from, she leaned over and whispered ever heard of it. After this, I got up and excused myself from the room because I was getting upset and she was getting on my last nerve. When Ally asked me later why I had left, I said that her Harvard superiority complex was showing and I didn't want to be around her elitist nastiness. Ever since then, she hasn't spoken to me and hasn't made any more jokes. However, my other co-worker said that I should have been the bigger person and that she wasn't trying to be nasty and to just let her be proud of where she graduated from. Now I'm wondering if I went too far. Am I the asshole? Not the asshole. Denigrating your school doesn't have anything to do with her being proud of her own school she does it because she's a flaming asshole who has made her entire personality about her alma mater, which is super weird and douchey. Ask your coworker why Ally can't be proud of her alma mater without insulting yours. Geese, Cornell was famous for a lot more than a sitcom, including Carl Sagan and Great Ornithology Site. Why is the injured party always asked to be the bigger person? Not the asshole. A comment once or twice is one thing. Constantly cracking jokes is either harassment. You already asked her to knock it off and she refused to do so. Okay, I didn't go to an Ivy at all so still admire you, but I had a good friend who went to Cornell and she said the entire student body bonded because they all had one thing in common they were rejected by Harvard and I have never forgotten it. That said, do you know how many terrible people have gone to Harvard? Pick one and start calling her by that name. Next time she's wearing her crimson sweatshirt, act surprised and say whoa, I thought you were the Unabomber for a second and then just call her Ted every time she calls you Andy. Not the asshole. Not the asshole but what you should have done is gone to HR instead. As a Boston native, Harvard kids suck us in general. If you want a tip to get on her nerves, refer to it as UMass Cambridge. Not the asshole. She can be as proud of Harvard as she wants but what she can't do is belittle a coworker. She is being nasty and trying to assert her superiority over you don't let her. Isn't Harvard that one that people joke about? How do you know someone went to Harvard? Don't worry, they'll tell you. Her identity is her f***ing college and she doesn't even go there anymore. Tell Harvard Barbie to get a personality or something. Actually probably better to just complain to her instead of talking to her what with it being a law firm. Not the asshole. Had a grad school classmate who was so impressed with attending Yale University as a college student my friends and I counted how many times he mentioned Yale in a talk. My count was one more than theirs and I said because he wore a Yale sweatshirt it counted. My advisor who graduated from Yale's grad school and was very amused by the whole thing. Not the asshole. Why do so many people say that allowing yourself to be repeatedly hurt is somehow making you a bigger person? They should instead have told the Harvard person to stop the repeated insults. Not the asshole tell your co-worker that what they said is enabling and that you will make sure to mention that when you speak with HR about Lil Miss Harvard. Ah this old joke has a nugget of truth, how do you know if someone graduated from Harvard? 
Wait 10 seconds and they will tell you. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. I used to work with a bunch of Harvard grads and they were almost universally the most socially maladapted people I've ever encountered in the working world. I don't mean weird, I work in technology everyone is weird, I mean totally incapable of not being sneering, condescending ass to everyone and while simultaneously being wrong about things at least 50 of the time. Just totally incapable of functioning in a group setting with people from different backgrounds with different experiences and perspectives, not to mention superior knowledge. Not the asshole. The obsession Americans have with what post-secondary institute people attend after high school is so baffling. Harvard is only impressive if you casually discover someone went there. If they told you directly it's cringy and embarrassing. Not the asshole. She was being unprofessional, if not outright harassing you. Not the asshole. The way she's acting about Harvard is what made Andy so cringy in the show. How she doesn't see that is kind of hilarious to me, but you shouldn't have to be the butt of her every joke if you've asked her nicely to stop. Not the asshole, not at all. The other co-worker defending her is more of an AH than you. If that was your reaction the first time she made a remark, maybe it would have been a bit much, but to repeatedly ask her to stop and her blatant disregard makes her the H. Yes Ted the serial killer. Not the asshole. It is no longer a joke when you say stop and she continues. And anyone who thinks you need to be a bigger person to an asshole is also one. Not the asshole. she was being rude even if it wasn't intentional and she hasn't apologized. School pride is fine but poking fun at someone isn't. Not the asshole. Tell that other co-worker to mind their business. Hopefully they never feel targeted bullied mocked while in a professional setting. You let ally know and that's enough. Lowest level of escalation possible. Document it for yourself and keep being professional. Not the asshole. I'm calling BS on she wasn't trying to be nasty. Don't be gaslit. She's the type who can dish but not take. Outshine her and ignore the crybaby tears. Not the asshole. You absolutely, positively, were the bigger person. You asked her to stop, you tried to extricate yourself, and in the end, you explained to her why what she said was a problem. That she cannot accept that she was being a mean girl leading up to it does not mean you were in any way wrong. And she absolutely needs to have the Harvard superiority knocked out of her, because more and more people are recognizing that it really isn't a thing, and if you make your entire life about where you went to school you will have a small, petty life. Not the asshole. Anyone that name drops their college name or wears the merch years and years out at non-sporting events is pretty weird. Who gives a shit where anyone went to college if you end up in the same place? ETA congrats on going to an Ivy but it's also like, you'll spend four years of your life somewhere don't need to name drop or belittle others especially when it's another Ivy. Not the asshole. You hurt her feelings, but it's probably a good thing for her to be more self-aware. She's not on campus anymore. You asked her to stop she didn't ta. Not the asshole. She was being shitty. You did what you had to. Not the asshole. Try living in the same place as the show. That gets old fast. Not the asshole. She can be proud of Harvard all she wants. But she's an AH for mocking where anyone went to university. If she made the joke once you should have let it go, which you did. If she made the joke repeatedly which she did you are right to shut it down. Your co-worker needs to understand that ally can be proud of where she went without putting down where others went. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. She was being a pitter and you just finally had it. You just did the same thing to her that she did to you and she didn't like it. Absolutely not the asshole. Sounds to me like you did exactly what needed to be done. 
saying the joke to you once would have been enough maybe even too much for you personally but she created the problem by her continued remarks. You put her in her place, no need to feel like you went too far. Hold your head high, do a great job and enjoy your new job. Good luck, and again not the asshole. Not the asshole. Seems like the Andy Bernard jokes flew right over her head. Not the asshole. Arp school is a good one and the fact she can't even come up with an original punchline despite her so-called superior education speaks volumes. Not the asshole you didn't even insult her you just told her exactly how she was acting and how she was insulted.